So you guys obviously live together for years. You mean now? Yeah. Yeah. But you guys snuggle. Do you guys watch a movie and snuggle together? Yeah. We do. <laughs> That's you know who doesn't That's cuddle? Who? He doesn't cuddle. Oh. Don't you think it's a waste of time a little bit? I no. Don't. It seems like a time to connect with someone. No. Is that Thank crazy? you, Cheryl. But Robert, can you back me up on this, right? Oh. <laughs> When you first met him, did you think he was attractive? I thought, you know what? It, it, he wasn't really my vibe. Oh. oh in your face. <laughs> oh, man. How does How that feel? How sad is that, man? <laughs> Holy man, you got to live with that. What? I remember him wearing a pleated khakis, and I was like, whoa. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Dude. That's not my vibe. But no also, one's vibe. That's no one's that's vibe. No one's vibe. She got me out of those immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That sounds weird. Because you look great now. I'm, <laughs> what you're wearing now, I love. You know? Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool jeans. My, this was my uniform, <laughs> you know, blue jeans before I got sober. Oh, okay. It was part of my spiritual realignment when I came in. Mm. I switched to khakis, but then she... <laughs> <laughs> she broke your spiritual life. Yeah. Yeah. It, like, it was like a slow burn then. Well, I didn't even, I never saw him. I, ne I never really thought about him, no offense. Um, for <laughs> years. She came to another event. Yeah. Seven years later. Mm. And then there was like a little connection like, oh, oh, hi. I knew when I wanted to date her, when I could tell how attracted she was to me. <laughs> <laughs> I went to Larry. I know Larry has a lot of rules about that kind of stuff, mm. since she was his television wife, and that it would be important that I ask his permission. So I, <laughs> I said, I, I, want, I want you to know that I'm uh, attracted to Cheryl, and what would, you, what would you think if I was dating her? He acted very excited and happy, and he, he said some things about Cheryl that I now know to be true. He said she was the most perfect human being that he'd ever oh. met. And that <laughs> he said she was beloved in her industry, that she was the only person in the industry who didn't have a single enemy. Yeah. If you like this video and you want to learn more about me and the movement that we're building, please go to Kennedy24.com.